Midland Park Police, PSP Lamb. Hey, it's Steve Police. How are you? I'm good. How are you? Good. I have a woman on the phone. She's calling from Long Island. She was on the phone with her friend um, who has a recent order of protection mm -hmm. um, from an ex-boyfriend. Okay. I'm looking up her driver's license. It looks like she lives in Midland Park. So I'm going to ask that you guys do a welfare check uh, for this woman, if nothing else. Okay, where? Um, it's number 715 Godwin Avenue. Is there an apartment okay. number or just that? It just says 715 Godwin Avenue on her DL. Okay. I, I, the woman, I, you could talk to her friend. Um, I can conference her in with you. I just wanted to give you that address because her friend doesn't know um, off the top of her head. She doesn't know her address. So I don't want to give her or provide her with any information that she might not already have. Okay. And I don't really know how to confirm who this woman is or how she's, you know, related to this woman. But what she said to me, which is concerning, is that she's got an order of protection. She was on a hands-free device talking to her friend. Um, and I said, well, was it possible that what you heard was background noise, like some guy talking to her? And she said, no, it was definitely my friend screaming. Um, she was having a conversation with her, and then all of a sudden she hears a guy say, I'm sorry to have to do this to you, or sorry, you know, she'll, she'll repeat it, but she said, I'm sorry to have to do this to you, or sorry that I'm doing this to you, mm -hmm. and then sh her friend started to scream, like shriek. Okay. Um, so she actually thinks that she's being assaulted or in danger. She has her phone number. Um, I don't know as far as if, if she's not home, if you want to then start a ping on it um, to, you know, find out where she is. Uh, her, the woman's name is Suzanne. You're doing a welfare check on Suzanne, S-U-Z-A-N-N-E. Last name is Bard Zell, uh, Bravo Alpha Romeo Delta Zulu Echo Lima Lima. I'll give you her driver's license number so they have an image. And okay, one second. Mm-hmm. Okay, go with that. Mm -hmm. And it looks like she drives a uh, black Volkswagen, a 2013 black Volkswagen, and the plate on that should be Mike. Okay. Um, and I'm gonna bring the um the friend on the phone now. Hey, you're from the state police, right? Yeah, and my last name is Tatmos. P as in Paul, A T M O S. Okay, and you said you heard her screaming? Oh my God, we were having a normal, like, conversation about stuff. And I believe she was driving, she had that earpiece thing on, or whatever, and then she, she, all of a sudden she's like, oh my God, no, like, screaming, yelling. Mm -hmm. I'm like, oh my God, Suzanne, what's the matter? And I did hear some guy in the background, and I, I don't know where she is, she's not answering the phone. Okay, and you're not sure of her address. You know the history of this whole thing, I'm sure. You're not sure I mean, of the address. There's been going on. You're not sure of the address. Her address? Yeah. She, I don't. She wasn't home, and I can't find my address book. The only time I mail her anything is the Christmas card. Okay. You know. And you said you heard a, a male's voice, and then she started. Screaming. In the background, when she was screaming, no, 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 screaming. It sounds like, I mean, she's not missing. She's, somebody's hurting her. Otherwise, I would never call the police. Okay, and you're not positive she's home and she's, and she was on the No, I'm not positive. She's a teacher. I think she was on her way home. Okay. Where does she work? Um, she works at te the private school in Teaneck. There's so many, if you go back to the past two weeks, there's so many reports. Okay, uh, so we'll, we'll send, we have a, a phone or uh, address on file. We'll, uh, God, help me. we'll send somebody over there. And she, she okay, well, she has a new cell phone number because she wanted to block. All right, what's the cell phone number? And uh, you said there's a lot of history. Do you know who with? Uh, oh, yeah, Artie Lamondo. Artie yep. Lamondo? Yes, you can pull the whole thing up. It's still going on. Okay. Um, yeah, we'll send somebody and, over there. And, yes, correct. All right, we'll send officers over to her house, see if she's there, and if she's not, we'll uh, go from there and try to track her down. Okay. All right. Thank you. You're welcome. Right. Bye. Bye.